to the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. Stop. Just the A part. One more time. It says, then they cried unto the Lord. There is a mystery when a man cries to the Lord. I used to think it meant just lifting your voice and be loud until God opened my eyes. Every time you see them say in their distress, they cried unto God. In their distress, crying unto God is more than talking. Crying unto God first starts with a revelation. That Lord, if you don't help me in this issue, I am finished. It's a revelation. For as long as you have options, you will never see God arise in your life. Until you exhaust all your options. And you come to a point where you say, Lord, they gave me the drugs in the hospital. But I acknowledge that is crying unto God. That you say, Lord, you are my priority. If you don't give me a husband, I cannot get one. If you don't give me a job, there is no job for me. Crying to the Lord is more than just saying, Oh God, help me. Blind Bartimaeus cried. And this was his cry. Thou son of David, art not thou miracle worker. I know you. I know your power. Will you pass me by and leave me in my distress like this? I'm blind. But I've heard about you. That you are the God who can wipe the tears of people. I've heard about you. That you are the one who makes the barren to sing. I've heard about you. That you are the one who raised Job back. I've heard about you. It says they cried unto the Lord. Whenever you are in trouble. Stop discussing. The key is to cry unto God. We have prayer requests here. Many of us are standing, trusting God to touch us. The key tonight is to cry unto God. And the Bible says he delivered them out of their distresses. Verse 28. 28 very quickly. One more time. Let's read. One to read. Again, then they cried unto the Lord in their trouble. And what did he do? He bringeth them out of their distresses. Next verse. He maketh the storm a calm so that the waves thereof, the waves that are killing you, that looks like you will not survive. He says God has the ability. There is something he can tell that trouble. It must hear his voice. Next verse. He says then, as a result, they are glad because they be quiet. So he bringeth them where? Unto their desired heaven. Listen. God knows your intentions. God knows your desire. He has the ability to bring you to where? Your desired heaven. But the key, after gratitude, you are authorized to cry. To cry to the Lord is not an embarrassment. When you cry, you are saying, Oh God, let your goodness and your mercy speak. At this point, it's not because of what I have done. At this point is, if it is with my intellect, if it's with my money, if it's with my connection, I have failed. I cry to you in my distress. In the next one minute before I minister, we are going to cry to God. Listen, I told you crying to God is a revelation. A revelation that acknowledges him as your only source. Tonight you are going to say, Lord, you are the only one. You are the only one who can heal me. I know this. And tonight I cry to you. The Bible says he can calm the storm. 
he can calm the storm oh yes he can lift your voice and cry to your maker thou son of David let your goodness and your mercy speak over me tonight pray Lord there is nothing new about my situation you have done it before the Bible is full of records of your faithfulness how you parted the Red Sea before people how overnight you turned the captivity of men and women pray Lord I don't know how you will do it but I know you can do it they cried unto the Lord in their trouble he said call upon me in the day of trouble cry to the Lord my rent has expired I'm not working I have no idea but I cry to you I have multiple carryovers I don't know what will happen to me but I cry to you thou oh God the lifter up of my head the one who is able to change my story I have not come to an idol it is within your power to help me oh thou Ebenezer arise for me you are my Ebenezer the helper of man God can help you listen to me God can help you God can help you they cried unto the Lord in their distress cry unto the Lord and watch what you will do in your life don't give him options don't give him options Lord you are my only source I cry to you pray my only hope of entering into my desired heaven some trust in horses some trust in chariots but we will trust in the name of our God Lord, step in to the impossible, to the impossible. Lift your voice and sing inside and outside. Lord, step in to the impossible, to the impossible. Come on, let your faith rise tonight. Lord, step in to the impossible. Lord, step in, Lord, step in to the impossible, to the impossible. One more time. Lord, step in, Lord, step in. Step in. Hallelujah. The Lord is healing a lady right now. Please check yourself and you just come out to testify before we continue. I'm seeing a lady. You came here with severe pain on your neck. Check it now. Check it now. The Lord is touching you. The Lord is touching you. I'm seeing an elderly man in this place. Um, you've been having pains towards the lower abdominal region. The Lord has just touched that man right now. He's an elderly man. I don't know where that person is. Please testify. Check yourself. And immediately you find out you are healed. Make your way to the front. Make your way to the front. God is touching people right now. I don't know who I'm seeing an ear. God is touching someone's ear. 
it's like I don't know if it's an ear issue but God is touching it right now God is touching it right now God is touching it right now please check yourself and make your way right now right now let's just have two or three of those people God is touching it right now right now doing a miracle for somebody um, I'm seeing somebody that has I don't know if it's um, I don't know what to call it but it's like a serious stomach issue it comes and hooks you literally you are gasping for breath when that happens to you it's like it literally holds you check yourself now you'll find out that the Lord has touched you make your way to the front very quickly you can make your way right here miracles are happening come on give Jesus praise miracles are happening miracles are happening God is touching people right now can you give Jesus praise God is touching people God is touching people right now I'm seeing someone with an eye problem you see like a black object it comes and goes it's like a it's, it looks like a needle like a black object you'll be looking at people and then you will see it this has happened for a while but God has touched you right now who is that person make your way to the front right now I'm seeing someone's left leg outside in the overflow there is someone with a left leg issue left leg is like you came towards the, the, the um, this area where I'm holding I'm seeing the power of God touch that area check it right now check it right now and confirm your healing and make your way to the front check it right now confirm your healing make your way to the front hallelujah have they checked themselves sir? you've checked yourself okay so quickly we'll just take two or three you can turn please come up come up let them come up when you come you can stand please come up man come up sir go ahead just tell us quickly straight to the point praise the lord uh, i have an ear issue and it normally scratch me sometimes okay and i'm feeling better by completely give right jesus now. praise hallelujah give jesus praise it never returns to you in the name of jesus yes sir please let's celebrate jesus celebrate what he's doing yes. Yes, for some years I have been experiencing pain here. Pain at yes. the lower abdominal yes, region. Abdominal yes. yes, you know, I gave a word of knowledge yes. that there was somebody lower abdominal. Better. And it's how, how better. about now? Exactly, it's better. In the name of Jesus Christ, Lord, we declare that it is perfected. Wow, the power of God is coming on you. It's perfected right now. Never to return to you. In the name of Jesus. Please check it, sir. Check it, check it right now. Check it. It's Check getting it. better. Yes. I'm feeling better. I'm feeling you will better. be perfected in the name of Amen. the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Give Jesus praise. Praise the Lord. For the past two weeks now, I've been having ear pain. Ear it's pain. A, it's an attack. Okay. I have cold. I have cataract. So this thing blocked my ear. I don't used to hear very well. So now I'm I'm okay. Completely. Yes. Madam, what the Lord is bringing increase for you. I'm seeing attack. I'm seeing a serious attack. Your money has gone down. Yes. Because this, this I'm seeing this has to do with, I don't know if you sell hair or you are doing I, something. I have salon in center. I'm, I'm, I'm seeing it's like an attack. This thing yes, has gone down. People are not even coming the way it used to be yes, before again. Yes, is that true? Yes. The Lord is saying, I should tell you in this miracle service, a restoration comes for you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the restoration comes for you right now. In the name of Jesus, give Jesus praise. God is visiting situations right now. Visiting situations right now. Go ahead, please, quickly. I want to thank God because I've been having serious pain on my neck at times. Neck pain? Yes, okay, the lady I said with neck pain, how long? It's like, it's for months, it comes and goes. At times, it's like my entire head, my ear, it affects my ear, but... When you were speaking, I, I just turned and I felt it was gone. You felt it was gone. Hallelujah. Now, there is a lady, while they were giving a testimony, there's a lady here. You felt like a cold sensation. Something just came upon you right now. It's a miracle that God has given you. Who is that person? Come out. You are in this row. Where are you? Come. You felt like a cold sensation. Something just came over you. Come. Come. This night, God is bringing restoration. Oh, Father, in the name of Jesus, let your anointing bring restoration for her right now. Right now, in the name of Jesus Christ. 
tremendous restoration i'm seeing a crown being put upon your head are you together are you together i'm seeing a crown oh you felt the same thing i'm praying for you madam the lord is averting cs the lord is averting cs because you see the anointing is on you the lord is averting cs i'm seeing a spirit standing by the theater and i'm seeing that this is even supposed to destroy this baby that they say this baby comes out and is affected but the anointing of the spirit is upon you right now as i'm speaking and i release the power of god right now let that demonic substance out of her now out of her in the name of jesus christ i see miracles everywhere miracles everywhere miracles everywhere Is your family here is the time for the visitation where is our family please come there is a whole deliverance for a family that God is doing here right now I see that family please where is our daddy and our mommy please appreciate them as they come enough of the nonsense of darkness please celebrate them as they come miracles everywhere miracles Miracles everywhere right now, right now. Hallelujah. Sir, I'm looking at you and I'm seeing a cause. This is what I'm seeing. As I look at you, the Lord is showing me this is a cause. Number one, it has tied down your finances completely down. This thing is so embarrassing, it has tied down everything. I don't know who is it in your family that has dreams. I see dreams of someone chasing somebody. I don't know which of your children or who now but i'm seeing one of those people have dreams that's their daughter you see the power of god touching her she's their daughter she's the person with this case i'm mentioning i'm seeing dreams and it's like people pursuing the person this thing started right from your family and this is already following this lady because i'm seeing now that the devil wants to put fibroid in her stomach it's starting now as pain I, I remove that fibroid right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ I cause that seed of fibroid by the power of the Holy Spirit I'm seeing this woman crying before God in prayer this is what I'm seeing this woman has been a defense I'm seeing her crying before God and saying Lord will you not wipe our tears in this family but tonight we see miracles everywhere Miracles everywhere. Miracles everywhere. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. We see miracles everywhere. But every time they want to indicate helping you, something just comes and nobody is willing to help you. Because I'm looking at you in the realm of the spirit. I'm seeing a body but I'm not seeing a face. This thing has covered your glory. Whoever is supposed to help you misunderstands you. And for some reason, they, uh, they don't help again. Hallelujah. Who is Adamu? I'm hearing a name, Adamu. Adamu, I'm hearing something that has to do with Adamu. Adamu, please help, help those on Adamu, I'm hearing Adamu. Who is that? Adamu, Adamu, huh? Where is your father? The person I'm talking about, his father's name is the one that is Adamu. Huh? What's your father's son name? Adamu. Adamu, yes. God is giving Adamu a miracle. Yes. Your father, right? Where is he? Adam, Nazareth State. In Nazareth State, yes, sir. because. This enchantment that is done against your family, enough is enough. It's part of your prayer request, right? Yes, number five, six, uh, number two and three. Yes, number two and three prayer requests. Yes, sir. Look at it there. Yes, that's sir. it. Number two and number three. That's what you wrote. Lord, Read it. Miracle Read it. Miracle in your family. Yes, that's what I'm reading, what you are writing. And God is giving a miracle, yes, a big miracle to Adamu. Miracles everywhere. I see miracles everywhere Right now Right now Right now Right now see miracles I see miracles everywhere Lord, we see miracles Miracles 
is ministering to me I'm seeing the anointing of the spirit I'm looking at a map and I'm seeing the spirit of God going to Yola Yola a miracle is happening in Yola and it's going to this lady's family this lady right I'm seeing a miracle but there are two other people from Yola from Yola I see the power of God moving two people from Yola it will come like a tornado upon you. It's a miracle that God is doing right there. There is a lady's elder sister who has been barren. I'm seeing the number three, three years. Barren, barren, help them. That lady is from Yolan. She's an usher, she's walking. But the spirit of God, I'm seeing is a wicked demon. This is what I'm seeing. That has been oppressing her family. I don't know if she's from Yola or not. But I'm seeing that God is doing a serious miracle. Sir, I'm going to pray for you. Mommy, I will minister to you. Madam, the Lord is saying I should tell you that the crying is over. The crying is over. Right now as I speak, the power of God is coming on you. The Lord is saying I should tell you the crying is over. Right now, the angel of the Lord is pouring something that looks like oil upon your head pouring it right now in the name of the lord jesus christ by the anointing of the holy spirit pouring what looks like vials of oil now i curse this spirit i address you by the power of the holy spirit let this family go now 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 this curse that has tied down the family even the lawful captive shall be delivered he said for i will contend with them that contend with you right now the power of god is touching people i see deliverance 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 fire lift your hands everybody let's just interrupt this deliverance fire right now it will start touching people at the count of three father the angels of god there are many angels in this place bringing deliverance for families at the count of three let that fire come right now one two three receive it right now right now right now right now bring them out deliverance for families outside i'm seeing the angels of the lord go outside outside the power of god is moving it's like fire coming on families it's like fire it's like fire it's like fire it's like fire we see miracles everywhere miracles everywhere miracles everywhere right now right now we see miracles everywhere we see miracles miracles everywhere we see miracles miracles everywhere Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Father, where are those families you showed me in the place of prayer? That from the village. Now, I'm not one who just talks so much about village. But this one is from the village. I see an attack at the count of three. One, two, three. From the village. Those arrows back to sender. Shakatata. Leketata, Reketatata. From the village, I see enchantments. From the village, I see altars. I see covens. I set them on fire. I set them on fire. I set them on fire. They are calling your names. from the village from the village enchantments witchcraft death outside outside fire is falling what fire is falling 
Fire is falling from the village. Speakings of death. Enchantments of death. Yahweh. 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 The name above all names. We call you Yahweh. We call you Yahweh. I'm ready to pray for you now. I didn't just leave you. I need to pray for you. My God, there is massive deliverance going on in this place. My dear, lift your hands where you are. An angel of the Lord is touching you right now. Right now. Mama, an angel of the Lord is touching you. He's doing something in your husband's life. Your husband's life. There is a miracle that is happening. Madam, your time for a miracle has come. Come. This woman, this woman wearing pink. No, no, no. I mean, that one. The one turning back. Yes, you, madam, come. Your time for a serious visitation has come. Let's stretch our hands towards daddy. Bring her. Be delivered now. I curse that spirit. Go! Stretch our hands towards daddy and mommy. Let's pray for them. Father, this plague must stop. I saw a curse. It was looking like a hollow over your head. It follows you everywhere you go and brings bad luck to your life. Father, in the name of Jesus, it's over. By the power of the Holy Spirit, I announce a new season. I announce a new season. Mommy, the spell is broken. Broken, 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 broken. In the name of Jesus Christ. Sir, I hold your hands in the name of Jesus and I announce to you that it's a new season. You will go back and experience dramatic turnaround. In the name of Jesus Christ. Don't think it will come from all the channels you are planning. Unusual sources of breakthrough. In the name of Jesus Christ. God bless you. Madam, I want to pray for you. Do you have a daughter? Is she here? One is here? I'm seeing one of your child here. Where is the person? A girl? A lady? A girl, yes. A lady, where is she? Please call her name, let her come. Daughter, where are you? Who is the person? She's wearing something like traditional dressing. Who is that? Come. This has been your desire that God will visit your family, right? It's been your desire, it's been your prayer yes, sir. that God yes. will visit your family. Yes, sir. And tonight, God has chosen to step in. See, it's an awesome thing when the light of God turns to you. Then you know that your situation has come to an end. I mustn't call you. It's not just by word of knowledge. It's not just by word of knowledge. lady is going to vomit something I'm seeing something that looks like a snake moving in her stomach this is like I don't know if it's poison this is something that has been put to this lady I curse that devil I curse you back to hell back to hell from where you came from hallelujah mommy please stand up let me pray for you man you can stand up please I want to pray for you. God is going to bring dramatic breakthrough to your life. Please, I want you to note it. Dramatic breakthrough. It will so surprise you. Hold my hands. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, let captivity come to an end. 
in the name of Jesus captivity comes to an end I release supernatural breakthrough supernatural breakthrough supernatural breakthrough in the name of Jesus and for you supernatural breakthrough mama I pray the Lord told me that the tears have come to an end He's wiping your tears father thank you for your word in the name of Jesus Christ I pray in the name of Jesus Christ I pray in the name of Jesus Christ I pray remember not the former things the Lord says I should tell you in this season he's doing new things he will change the heart of your husband in a way that you never imagined he will do this for his glory the spell of bad luck over your life is broken bad luck there's something about your life that makes people hate you it's a spirit and there are people here lift your hands everybody I'm praying for you whatever makes people hate you for no reason I want you to know that it's not normal you will see what will happen right now there are people here I know that people have those kinds of things but there are people with those things it's like an aura on you as I was ministering to her the Lord said minister to the house father where are they right now in the name of Jesus let the anointing locate them inside and outside that spell of bad luck right now right now in the name of Jesus 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 Justina the Lord is bringing miracles to your family miracles to your family I'm seeing a lady from is it Oka Oka that should be East I'm, I'm, Oka is anyone from like that I'm seeing a lady our minister generally will pray for the sick now but I just want to flow Oka Oka is there someone like that please if you are like that you can make your way to the front the Lord wants me to pray for that family my dear you with a white hair tie that lady you turning back lift your hands where you are I don't know what it is that I'm seeing but God is destroying an embargo over your life and family Lord Jesus I destroy it right now in the name of Jesus where you are standing I destroy it by the power of the Holy Spirit you are from there you are from Oka. Where is that? Anambra State. Anambra State. Yes. I'm going to pray for you. You're also from there? Huh? Make your way to the front. You are from there too. Three of you. Look at me. You cannot be a victim, you and your sisters, of the wickedness of people in the village. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Hold my hands. Father, it must end. This must end. It must end by the anointing of the Holy Spirit. This is, this is, I'm seeing enchantment. This is, this is witchcraft to produce consistent failure in life. You and your sisters, I pray for you. Father, you are going to visit them in this season. You are going to visit them in this season. In the name of Jesus. I want to minister to you. You are from there too. Come stand. The Lord gave me that word and said to minister to the people. As I lay my hands and minister to you. I want you to know that everything that does not represent God. Huh? And everyone pursuing you in your dream. And disturbing you. It must end in the name of Jesus Christ. For you. There is, there is, I'm seeing something that looks like a crown in your head. We must remove it because it's not God that put that crown. Out in the name of Jesus Christ, that devil is a liar. Take it off of her in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Where is your mother, my dear? Huh? Abia State. Abia State. We are going to pray for you. Tell your mother that a deliverance is coming for her, then a breakthrough. Deliverance first, then breakthrough. For the deliverance, she will see it in a dream. It's like something will be chasing her to catch her and she will see somebody who will snatch her out. It's a dream connoting deliverance. Father, visit this family. Out! In the name of Jesus Christ. You're a student here? Huh? Yes. We must pray for you so that the spirit that destroys men when they are about to finish huh? in your family, we must stop it. In the name of Jesus Christ, glorify yourself, oh God. I curse this spirit. 
in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Lift your hands, everyone. Before I begin to minister to the sick, God is bringing deliverance to families right now. We are going to shout Jesus at the count of three. This is not just to you, but God is stepping into families. Some of you never knew that what is happening physically in your family is as a result of all kinds of things. Devils. Lift your hands, everybody. At the count of three, you shout Jesus at the top of your voice. And the power of God will move mightily in this place. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray that you step into families and end every oppression and every captivity. Right now, I pray by the power of the Holy Spirit, every family, shakatatata, under any demonic siege, my goodness, the power of God is already touching people. Right now, at the count of three, let that shout be like a code in the spirit. One, two, three. Be delivered now. 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 Now, altars be broken. Altars be broken over families, over families, inside and outside. And those following online, I break it right now. Every family under any spell, every family, that's right, Kabatakata, bring them out. Shakatatata. Every family under any spell. Oh, you must leave them. You must leave them. I speak to those spirits. Hear my voice. In the name of Jesus. There is no hiding place for you. You must go. You must go. You must go. It's time for their deliverance. You must go. Hallelujah. My goodness, God is doing miracles right now. God is so help that lady, please. Help them. Sisters, lift your hands. I want to pray for just the sisters. Something remarkable will happen right now. Remarkable. There is a spirit that puts women in bondage. Because when one woman is in bondage, it can affect a thousand men. There are ladies, oh my goodness, the fire of God will move, not small sisters lift your hands lord by fire as the sisters cry that spirit that seraph that follows ladies and causes them visiting them in dreams as you shout jesus my goodness i pray that those fallen spirits that will not let you go that did not keep their original estate they will be judged right now Father, locate every one of these sisters right now. One, two, shout Jesus right now, right now, right now, right now, right now. Those spirits go, 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 Lift your hands. There are people here strange dreams strange dreams in the night you sleep in the night and you have all kinds of strange dreams from men or women or animals coming to sleep with you or people tying your legs and you see what is happening in the day whether you believe it or not is not the issue i want to settle those things right now lift your hands lord where are these people from the dream realm from the realm of the spirit as you shout the name jesus anyone under this condition some of you that's what is responsible for masturbation some of you that's what is responsible for pornography some of you that's what is responsible for delay lift your hands father those spirits that use the realm of dreams and visions and manipulate destinies manipulate the stars of your people at the count of three we set them on fire fire comes upon you now many guys will be affected one two three 
Oh, I bring you deliverance in the name of Jesus. I cause those spirits, causing delay. You must leave now, 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 now. Shaba ba ba ba, shake te te te, kapra ta ka ta ta ta, shake te 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 te, reke te te te, go 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 go. Watch what they're doing. Shaka ta 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 ba na na ba, em protoko to pariata. That spell of delay must leave. Hallelujah. Lift your voice in one minute. I'd like you to pray and cause delay from your life. In the next one minute, open your mouth and say enough is enough. I must move forward. Pray. Please pray. Take it seriously. It's called a miracle service. It's called a miracle service. Pray. Lord, I'm tired of delay. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Prophesy. I'm moving forward. This is the ninth month. By the blood of Jesus. I'm moving forward. I'm moving forward under this anointing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I like you to shout after me. Say in the name of Jesus. Every gate and every obstacle standing between me and the next level by the blood of Jesus. I bring those gates down. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Shakatatata. Sheketekete. Gates of limitations standing before me and my desired heaven. Gates of limitation standing before me in the name of Jesus. Gates of limitation standing before me and my desired heaven. Outside, make sure you are praying. Pray. You will return with a testimony. You are praying under a corporate anointing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Everything that belongs to me and is not yet in my life in this season by the power of faith I command them to manifest open your mouth and begin to pray open your mouth and pray come on koinonia everything every lifting every glory that belongs to me and has refused to manifest by the power of faith even God who quickened the dead and called those things that be not as though they were. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Every legal access, every claim the devil has over my life, over my family, by the blood of Jesus, I declare that I'm free. By the blood of Jesus, I command my liberty. I declare that the price for my freedom has been paid. Therefore, Satan, stay off my life. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Stay off my life. The price has been paid by the death of Jesus. 
every cause every yoke every spell every enchantment by the blood of Jesus pray Hallelujah. I want you to listen to me carefully. I'm doing this by the Spirit. Listen, many breakthroughs are happening to people just from this simple prayer. I wish that God could open your eyes to see the things that are happening to people. You are, this is not just your normal prayer. You are under a heavy anointing. Listen, human beings have prophetic atmospheres. The ark of God came into the house of Obed Edom and brought him good. Jonah entered a boat and made people to be destroyed. Listen, some of you are good people, but you are carrying a spiritual atmosphere that brings bad luck to you and everybody connected to you that's what prophets sometimes will see and because they don't have discernment they call people witches and wizards they are not witches and wizards they are sincere people but they carry a spiritual climate that everywhere they go it makes certain things to happen do you understand now some of you are sincere people but you are carrying atmospheres that makes everything around your life to fail we are going to pray say after me in the name of Jesus by the blood of Jesus this is a strong prayer this simple prayer you are saying you will see the result instantly I like you to pray and say every atmosphere that I carry that does not come from God and is responsible for bad luck and misfortune in my life tonight I declare let that atmosphere change lift your voice and pray seriously lift your voice and pray seriously every negative atmosphere kaparatata pray miracles are happening pray every negative atmosphere pray that brings bad luck I may be a sincere person but it brings repeated misfortunes I challenge it whether ancestral whether territorial I challenge it I change my spiritual climate by the blood of Jesus hallelujah two more prayer points and we'll pray for the sick hallelujah we are going to pray a prayer of restoration do you believe in restoration nothing is ever truly lost it only leaves your presence I like us to pray. Yeah, that's the song. Everything that was lost shall be returned unto me. Everything that was stolen shall be restored unto me. Everything that was lost shall be returned unto me. Everything that was stolen. One more time. Forget about your situation, just prophesy. Just prophesy. You may not know how it will happen. Just prophesy. One more time. Prophesy. Everything that was lost shall be returned unto me. Everything that was stolen shall be 
shout it say in the name of Jesus all the years all the fortunes every opportunity every access that has been lost in my life by the mercy of God I command them to come back to me go ahead and pray this is a serious prayer point all the years all the fortunes all the opportunities all the access that have passed your life pray like Samson pray like Hezekiah pray let there be a restoration and I will restore to you the years that the canker worm the palmer worm the caterpillar hallelujah hallelujah we're going to pray the last prayer point listen there are spirit entities that challenge and haunt the destiny of people in the realm of the spirit. When Jesus was born, certain men saw his star from the east and they started following that star. And the moment they announced to Herod, a king is born. Herod said, ah, a king. He said, please find where he is and tell me so that i will come and worship him but his intention was to kill him you are going to pray over your destiny please take this prayer point seriously shout it say in the name of jesus i declare that my destiny is secured by the blood every act of witchcraft that has tied down my destiny right now by the blood of Jesus release it now pray pray release my destiny release my destiny my prophetic potential release it release it hallelujah prophesy after me say in the name of Jesus this is my year of the rain it's a new dimension for me I'm breaking every limitation say it again I'm breaking every limitation and I declare that in this remaining part of the year an anointing comes upon my life that causes me to triumph that causes me to excel go ahead and pray it Lord is my year of the rain an anointing comes upon my life a speedy walk by the Holy Ghost a speedy walk of restoration a speedy walk hallelujah we're going to do two things at the same time right now listen if there is any trace of sickness and infirmity in your body it's time for it to die are we together now are we together now please just address these people we're going to have all those people come and line up while that is happening please i beg you if you do not write anything in your prayer request please if you need papers maybe the ushers can pass it we are going to be praying on everybody's request those on facebook some of your loved ones you are permitted to switch off your switch on your phone and tell them please send in your prayer request because god is about to do something right now while you are doing that be praying in tongues everybody be praying in tongues while sick people all those who brought sick people make your way to the front very quickly please very quickly all those trusting god for healings and miracles 
please just line up everything that was lost shall be returned unto you everything that was stolen shall be restored unto you everything that was lost shall be restored unto you everything that was stolen shall be restored unto you everything that was lost shall be restored unto you the devil is a liar he must let you go tonight that was stolen shall be restored unto you hallelujah we don't just lay hands on people i know that it takes a lot of time but it's the way God is directing us. It's not just ordinary hand laying. It's a prophetic point of contact. Some of you are coming out for sickness. But the truth about it is that there is an oppression of darkness. Is that the mama with cancer? Okay. No, no problem. No problem. She can come. If she cannot stand, just give her a seat. Let her sit down, please. Those who are weak and cannot stand, please, you can give them a seat so that they don't collapse. The, the woman with cancer, if she, if she cannot come, just I'll minister to her. Everything that was lost. Make sure you are writing your prayer request, please. Everything that was stolen shall be restored unto Hallelujah. All of you that are coming out, I want you to know that we are patient enough to minister to us. There are all kinds of ministries. This ministry is like a spiritual factory. It's like a spiritual workshop is where we dirty our hands on the job and as i minister to us please i want our hearts to be open don't just stand watching the power of god touch people the moment i lay hands on you and minister to you i want you to receive you can go back to your seat some of you will be under the anointing it doesn't matter as i pray for you you don't have to scrounge i will lay hands on everybody it's going to be a quick walk it will take time please when you write your request pass it to the ushers in case there are things listen listen let me teach you how to maximize this prayer point. Don't just write things carelessly. While you are writing, be praying in tongues. Because the Spirit of God will bring into your mind. Bring you into remembrance. It may even be a matter that is not your own. You heard the story of the gentleman. Dropped a prayer point and nine months later, they are coming with twins. There is nothing God cannot do. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray over your people. There are powers tying down their destinies. But you have put this miracle service as a prophetic platform. Let there be miracles. Go ahead. All of us, we can join praying in tongues while I pray for these people. Occasionally, worship team, you will help us. Lord, we give you praise. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Look at this. I don't know. They can't see it on screen. It's not clear. This is a leg that is bent. Father, do a miracle. They didn't fix it well. In the name of Jesus, right now. Let the power of God do a miracle on this leg. In the name of Jesus. Almighty God, you know me, man. You know me, man.
prayer point number two lord i take full delivery of everything you package uniquely for me tonight lift your voice i will not miss out on anything yeah. hallelujah who brought this woman please huh? what's the issue what's wrong she... hallelujah we'll soon be rounding up let's just hear no 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 keep us standing what's wrong I'm paralytic paralyzed yes. mama can she talk yes mama for how long because I paralyzed did. yes i went to the house and met she her can't walk on her own she can't walk very well mama in the name of jesus christ i curse this spirit it's okay in the name of jesus mama look at me in jesus name lift your hand lift it go don't look at, just lift it put it down lift it again paralyzed hand look at this look at this mama clear the way for her in the name of jesus christ walk come don't hold her come 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 turn around turn around walk come 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 on give jesus it's praise miracles say everywhere Miracles everywhere. Paralyzed. Miracles everywhere. Right now. Right. We see miracles. We see miracles. We see miracles. Right now. Right now. In the name of Jesus. Miracles everywhere. I break the power of paralysis. It never returns to you again. In the name of Jesus, you are the son that brought her. Are, she's not your mom, yes. but you brought her. Yes. I pray for you. May you never lack helpers in your life. Because you are a young man, you are not related to her. Yet you carried mama out of compassion. This miracle is because of you. I'm laying hands on you and I prophesy to you. All the days of your life, may helpers be around you like this. In the name of Jesus Christ for as long as your eyes can see the sun you will find a helper in the name of jesus christ god bless you celebrate mama god bless you there's a miracles everywhere make sure you submit your prayer request everywhere Ministry, I want you to come out. I, I don't mean you want to do ministry, you are actively in ministry. Come and stand here. It's time for you to take fresh fire. Please, if you come out and you are not a minister, I will send you back. I assure you, don't embarrass yourself. If you're a minister and you know, not just that you sense the call of God, please don't embarrass yourself. 
we are going to pray for everybody but if you are a minister come go ahead don't be afraid we are in a season of God's glory please listen we are in a season of God's remarkable grace it takes signs and wonders not just grammar and story the Bible is not waiting for the explanation of the sons of God for the manifestation please I like you to believe I'm going to do this very fast the Lord has instructed me immediately after we do that all visitors visit us alone I will not lay hands on you but I'll pray for you and then we'll pray for the request prophesy and we will we'll do all this within the next 10 minutes so that we're done father i pray it's not by might is not by power lord as i lay hands upon your servants let something new something divine my god i pray activate the gifts of the spirit in them activate the operations of signs and wonders Shkabalata. let utterance be given unto them let your life so oh god produce results results oh god results signs wonders miracles by your hand take the fire 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 Take the fire, 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 fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, new levels, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire new dimensions fresh grace my goodness fire is falling fresh fire fresh fire fresh fire fresh grace fresh fire fresh fire fresh fire fresh fire fresh grace fresh anointing new anointing new dimension gifts of the spirit Visions, dreams, prophecies, multiplied graces. I prophesy to all of you, let it be a new season in the name of Jesus. New season, new season, new season. I empower you for a new dimension in the spirit. I empower you, fresh grace. Fresh grace. Please stretch your hands towards the prayer request. Unto thee that answers prayers shall all flesh come. Please stretch your hands. It's a prophetic instruction God gave us. We have seen amazing testimonies. If there are still people left, please let them come. Let them drop it very quickly. In one minute, I'd like you to begin to pray. Lord, it's time to turn my story around. My goodness as we pray miracles will begin to happen to people right in the crowd right in the crowd as i'm touching the request something is happening to you something is happening i'm seeing angels lightning all over all over all over father in the name of jesus we pray go ahead and pray everyone
I release angels. I activate angels. I release angels. I activate angels. In the crowd right now. I turn this request to testimonies. I activate angels. Lord, solve problems, solve problems. Let burdens be removed. I activate angels. I activate angels. We cry unto you, O God of Jacob. We cry unto you, O God of Israel. Unto thee that answers prayer shall all flesh come. We cry unto you. We call upon your name. Turn the night of people into day. Turn their morning into joy, O God. Hallelujah. I tell you, mighty miracles are happening. I see all kinds of miracles happening in the realm of the spirit. Father, turn these requests into testimonies. The way I walk on them, oh God, these problems remain under our feet forever in the name of jesus christ under our feet forever in the name of jesus christ all our visitors please come out quickly if you're a visitor here you're a visitor this is your first time Hallelujah. The Lord spoke to us last year. He said we should prophesy and pray over the visitors. Some of you have traveled kilometers. You have traveled from different states of this nation, risking yourself through the night. Please make sure you come. Clear the way for them. You are a visitor. This is your first time you are coming here. Make your way to the front. Let's celebrate them. <laughs> Hallelujah. You see what I'm saying, people? The number of visitors that troop in every week into Zaria for Koinonia is getting so much. We have to find something to start doing around your regions so that we save some of you transporting yourself. Maybe we'll open a branch of Koinonia in all those places. Maybe we'll come to your village. Hallelujah. But seriously, we're trusting God for instructions for the next level. And I'm sure that very soon he's going to speak. But I perceive that very soon there's going to be a lot of expansion because of what God is doing. Hallelujah. Are you glad about that? Let's celebrate Jesus. God has brought you here. Your life will never be the same. Please lift your hands. Father, you have brought these people all the way. Some of them with burdens. Some of them coming to catch fire. I stretch my hands towards you. Kaborato shatabaladaba. Nandeka lekoroto suto prashia. My goodness, I see impartations happening to people. Those of you standing, I'm seeing impartations. It's like rain, rain touching people. That's what I see. These are showers of blessings, showers of miracles. I prophesy to you from tonight. Help them, help them, help them, help them, please. I prophesy to you. Step into new levels. In the name of Jesus Christ, step into new dimensions. This is Koinonia, a place of encounter. It's not just the name of a meeting. It's the name and the dimension of the operation of the Spirit. We bless you with hunger for God. We bless you with passion for the things of the Spirit. I'm praying for you. You will go back with such fire. You will go back with such passion you will not recover from. I pray that everything that has not been working in your life, let it be activated tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. I welcome all of you. Thank you so much for coming. This is Koinonia, a meeting put together by Eternity Network International. We are here every Friday.
um, this is not our usual venue our venue is Christ Gospel Church at New Extension but we thank you for coming I bless you in the name of Jesus and I'm praying for you from the depth of my heart and on behalf of everyone in this ministry and the many who are joining us online that you will return with a strange miracle in the name of Jesus you will return with a strange miracle some of you even before you get home your miracles will be waiting for you some of you this night you will have dreams and encounters and the veil over your eyes will be open some of you this night God will show you what has been happening in your life God will show you direction I see God giving a lot of you direction direction for the next level you will hear his voice very accurately in the vision of the night in the vision of the night he will show you in the name of Jesus Christ we bless you for those of you who have never been here I want you to follow the gentleman waving his hands they'll have your details outside very quickly and then you come and join us those of you who have been here and we have received you you can just go back to your seat with a blessing but those of you who have never been here you've not put down your name we need your names and details I want you to make your way here in the name of Jesus everybody rise as we receive the last prophecy for the meeting now you be God God, you know be my name. You know be my name. Now him be God. Almighty God. You know be my name. Two more times. Now you be God. Praise the Lord. Tomorrow morning we are off to Kogi State. We are going to be tearing down the walls of darkness. Trust God to set that territory free. Pray for us and if you come from Kogi, stand by us and tell and let's trust God to really do something apostolic in that land in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Now please, this for me, you always hear me say this. I consider this to be the most important part of the meeting because this is where everybody gets to receive the creative power of the spoken word the creative power of prophecy this is where the word of God comes into you like a drug and literally literally alters you and so I want you to receive with your heart open hallelujah please receive with your heart open in the name of Jesus Christ as I pray for you, I want you to receive by shouting a resounding amen. No more tears in the name of Jesus. No more tears in the name of Jesus. I prophesy no more tears in the name of Jesus. No more tears in the name of Jesus. No more tears in the name of Jesus. No more tears. No more tears. No more tears in the name of Jesus. These hands that are lifted, I prophesy. May a supernatural anointing come upon it. Let it begin to produce extraordinary results. In the name of Jesus Christ. Extraordinary results. I pray for everyone due for promotion. And every of your loved ones due for promotion in the name of Jesus we cause the embargo stopping their promotion and we prophesy promotion there will be testimonies of promotion the power of God is touching people everyone and every family called jobless I feel like fire on my hands as I'm about to pray this please help them I feel like fire on my hands everyone represented here and every family called jobless right now in the name of Jesus I release an anointing for supernatural jobs 
receive it receive it receive it help them please receive it receive it testimonies of jobs testimonies of jobs testimonies of jobs every delay in your life that has stopped you from entering where you should enter now makata kata tata pakata shekata kata kata tata tata the anointing that came on elijah that he guarded his loins and ran my bro toto pekete lekete te kototata receive that anointing right now i cause delay in the name of jesus i cause delay in the name of jesus everyone who has vowed that over their dead body for you to rise and your family to rise i declare that to their shame my god will lift you before them my god will lift you before them my god will lift you before them everyone who says can anything good come out of your life i prophesy to you in this season god will use your life to answer them god will use your life to answer them i pray for you in the name that is above all names whoever needs to come into your life in this season no let's start it this way whoever needs to go out of your life this season in the name of jesus if their presence has been causing you pain and setback i break you free from them now wrong associations be free from them now wrong relationships we break it now wrong soul ties we break it now wrong connections we break it now wrong fraternities we break it now we break it now we break it now i command them out of your life out of your family listen some of our parents the trouble in their life is because they have wrong friends they will never leave they keep influencing them to make useless decisions i pray for every family any stranger manipulating the destiny of any family through the council of Ahitophel, today we send them packing from their homes packing from your homes in the name of jesus until samuel appeared the destiny of saul remained covered until jesus appeared 12 years of hemorrhage continued whoever must appear in your life Whoever must appear, Magato Topata. You hear me talk of destiny helpers all the time. Your next level comes from God, but through the hands of a destiny helper. From the realm of the spirit, destiny helpers, I call you. From the north, from the north, from the south, from the east, from the west, wherever you are, locate God's people come into their lives in the name of jesus every academic challenge you have tried and done everything you know to do but you need a miracle in the name of jesus I release my faith upon with you. Receive academic miracles. Now, 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 now. Hey, Poto -to -to We activate angels to faculties, angels to departments, angels to faculties, faculty of art, 
science, environmental design, medicine, engineering, administration, education. We release them now. Miracles in the name of Jesus. That favor anointing that makes men run to look for people to bless them. I pray for you. When the favor of God came upon Mephibosheth, Saul looked for him and blessed him. Receive favor right now. Unusual favor. Uncommon favor. Uncommon favor. In the name of Jesus. Before I pray the last prayer point, listen, if you're here, and you've not given your heart to Jesus Christ, please. I can't pray this last prayer point without making this sure because I want to pray something dangerous. If you're here, you've never given your heart to the Lord, please listen, inside and outside. Or you once gave your heart to Jesus Christ, but for some reason, you see they're already coming out. Follow them. You found out that you need to make your ways right. Please, our time is limited. In one minute, inside and outside, you're welcome. Make your way to the front. God bless you bless you they are coming going on and celebrate them don't sit back don't sit back this is a family this is not all of you i believe there are still some people outside clear the way for them please clear the way god bless you sirs. bless you sirs. celebrate them jesus is calling you god bless you ma calling you to give you a new beginning please if they are coming clear the way for them so that they don't become discouraged motivate them clap for them Thank you, Jesus. Come, run to Jesus Christ. He will give you a new beginning. If the Holy Spirit is telling you to come out, come out. Don't sit back there. Don't sit back there. Many of you are hearing the nudging of the Spirit. He's saying, why are you sitting down? Don't argue with him. Make your way. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for coming out, brothers and sisters. I want to lead you in a prayer of salvation. It's not a poem. It's not a special number. It's a, it's a genuine prayer of dedication. God bless you. Hallelujah. Lift your right hand high to heaven and say this very passionately. Please, you are not reciting a poem. This is not an article. You are praying to God. This is a prayer that is going to save your soul and redeem you and empower you to be great. Say, Lord Jesus. I believe in you and I love you with all my heart I ask you to forgive me my sins I receive Jesus Christ into my heart be my Lord be my Savior from today my past is gone it's a new beginning I receive eternal life into my spirit the old is gone and the new has come in the name of Jesus Christ I pray for you right now I stretch my hands Father these ones have come to make a decision for you I pray that this decision will be permanent they will never backslide no going to the world no going to the flesh I release grace upon you to live the victorious Christian life in the name of Jesus Christ every wrong association every company of wicked and senseless people you will not have any appetite and desire to be close to them again. You will love them, but you will not associate with them again. I receive grace for you to edit your friends. Wicked and unreasonable people are far from you forever. In the name of Jesus Christ, I bless you. Congratulations in the name of Jesus. It's a new beginning. Please follow the gentleman waving his hands. And they will have your details. We'll follow you up in the name of Jesus. Please lift your hands for the last prayer point. I want to pray for the gift of the spirit to fall upon your life this is why i said we have to pray for them please lift your hands just a quick walk in one minute some of you have passionately desired certain things some of you have had dreams but you cannot understand god is speaking to you there are many of you that have longed to hear the voice of god you are praying and somehow you hear it but there is no clarity and direction there are some of us that are trusting god for newer levels of the anointing the gifts of the spirit please lift your hands in one minute i'm going to pray there will be a great impartation upon you 
all the gifts of the spirit the nine recorded in the bible and every other one that is available in god father i'm praying right now as your people shout i receive let there be mighty impartations there are people here who will carry strange fires strange grace at the count of three shout i receive one two three receive it right now right now right now right now gifts of healing impartations visions 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 prophetic encounters Kaparatata. receive it right now in the name of jesus word of knowledge word of wisdom gifts of leadership administration dreams visions entrepreneurship every gift available receive it now now please help that lady so she doesn't enjoy herself i pray for you what you could not do by the gift of the spirit go and begin to do it where you could not enter by this new anointing go and enter nothing dies in your hands in the name of jesus christ Celebrate. hello beloved in christ we hope this message was a blessing to you i would want you to do something for us if you are new here kindly hit on that subscribe button for us and then like this video as well share to your family and friends to bless them because we know that this message will be a blessing to their body to their soul and to their spirit we would need you to do one thing for us too tell us in the comment section where you were watching us from and if you've got any testimony for us kindly share with us thank you